uh, state troopers rushing to save a life soon realized they were fighting for one of their own. Lisa Jagger had her baby boy Ryan two weeks ago today, but the happiest moment in this new family's life soon turned to terror. She needed blood and fast. As Zena Morney reports, three troopers teamed up to get her help just in time. I've got quite a story to tell about him when he gets older. Grateful to be able to tell Ryan what happened the day he was born. He's a very good baby. He doesn't, um, he's not super fussy. Lisa Jagger almost didn't get to know him. It was kind of bizarre. I could hear everything that was going on around me, but I was not responding. She suffered a massive hemorrhage, losing more than half the blood in her body. Even in a haze of fear, she held on to hope. The fleet manager for the state patrol knew who would be coming to her rescue so she could get to hold her son. When I heard the doctor say, we're, we're ordering a blood run, in my head I went, I'll bet that's the troopers <laughs> that are running that blood. In a relay to save a life, troopers Jesse Einhorn, Jacob Laterno, and Dow Gang each took their turns, charting the path from St. Paul's Red Cross to the Mayo Clinic in Red Wing. The troopers learned halfway through that Lisa was the patient. I didn't drive any differently than I would have on a regular blood run because I'm going as quickly and as safely as I can, but it made it more personal. Typical blood runs to that hospital take 45 minutes. These troopers made it in 30. Probably would have been too long if it had taken that long. Um, we were that close. Full of ups and downs, a story to tell this young boy with a happy ending. There are no words. For how grateful I am for every everyone and everybody that um, that helped me out along the way. Nina Moyni, WCCO 4 News. The state patrol has already conducted 34 blood runs this year for patients in need. Lisa says she wouldn't have made it without the troopers, but also her doctors and the people who donate blood to the Red Cross. To learn about donating blood, visit WCCO.com/links.